Hey guys, it's KJ for you, and welcome back to my Space Engineers Let's Play. This is Season 1, Episode 2, and where we left last left off, we were just trying to get some components to build ourselves a mining ship, and uh, we are refining uranium ore for this ship as well, and I believe we are probably... Oh, we still have more iron. So that's good, because we need to make uh, steel plates. We're going to need quite a bit of these, but for now, I'm only going to make 40, uh, and that's good, because it, it doesn't seem to take a lot of... Uh, a lot of iron, so that's good. Start that up. And um, we also needed, uh, I think we need some large steel tubes. Uh, maybe some small steel tubes. I don't know what we're going to need. We need a lot of this stuff, so let's just go ahead and make it now. Yeah. Okay, so it's making everything there, so that's good. While that stuff is being made, we are going to go out and do some more mining. Because we need more resources. Uh, over here is a real nice spot. We got some iron. We got some... Uh, we got a lot of stuff over here. Uh, iron and, um, and uranium are actually the most important things to me right now. So let's go ahead and start mining this out. And our ship is giving us gravity. Remember that? So that's pretty cool. Uh, but our number one concern is to... Oh! Ooh, how'd that not kill me? Probably because my jetpack's on. No, it's not. My jetpack's off. Hmm. That's weird. Thank God that didn't kill me. All right, so let's pick up this iron ore. And this is a real chore to have to pick this stuff up. It's kind of annoying. So um, I'm not going to mine any more than I have to to get that first ship built. Uh, as a matter of fact, I should probably just... I probably have uh, enough now. But the thing is, I'm waiting for for the refinery to, or to refine stuff. And as I'm waiting for, you know, the assembler to build everything. Like, I really don't have anything else to do. Uh, let's see what we got done up there. I could pause the video, I guess. But uh, let's see what we got made already. I'm not going to pause the video until I absolutely have to. Alright. So the assembler has the plates, the steel tubes. We got the iron in here and small steel tubes. I don't know if I need small steel tubes. I just made them for the hell of it. Let's go ahead and throw the rest of this iron in here. And it looks like we have all our... uranium ingots so let's go ahead and throw the rest of these in here because this ship is like i said our lifeblood and uh there we go now we got a lot of uranium in there let's see how long it'll last without moving we got 14 days worth of fuel that is sweet okay very good so let's go down and uh, see if we can make some more of our ship here this uh this first ship i'm gonna make is gonna be a monstrous horrible looking ship i, I know it already because like it's my first one so what are you going to do? Alright, so we're going to put the thingamabob on top. Oh, come on. There we go. We're going to put one behind. And uh, I'm not quite sure how I want to build this. Um, I'm going to need a cockpit. Let's go ahead and make the cockpit. It's kind of hard to tell where I want to put stuff when I don't really know. Um, actually, can I put down the cockpit? Let's see if we can put down the cockpit. All right, so we can do this without turning off our jetpack. All right, so we need a cockpit. Um, there we go, cockpit number four. All right, that is um pretty monstrous looking thing. Let's uh, these blocks are pretty small. Do I have bigger blocks? Heavy armored? No, light armored blocks. That's what I'm supposed to be using. All right, well, let's make a couple more out. Um, I watched this one dude do this on a let's play, and and his ship looked looked okay. But I kind of want my ship to look a little better. Um, although, it's just the first mining ship. I should probably just get it freaking made. Alright, so there's the cockpit. And, uh... We need to turn that around. There we go. No, no, stop. Let me turn that around. Let's see if we can turn that around. Uh, page down. There we go. Alright, what do we need? We need interior plates. Okay. So, yeah, that's a good spot for it. I can live with that. Let's go make some in more interior plates. Oh, by the way, you can get to the uh, your crafting stuff from out here as well. The assembler and everything you can get to from out here, which is also pretty nice. It's a pretty nicely designed ship, to be honest. All right, so we need interior plates. Let's go ahead and make ten of those. What else are we going to need for the, uh, the cockpit? 
We're going to need displays, computers, motors, displays, computers, motors, displays, displays. We're going to need silicon wafers and gold. Yeah, yeah. We're going to need silicon wafers and gold. There's no way around that. Let's, uh, let's go mine for some. Silicon and gold. I don't think there's any down here. Well, yeah, there's some gold there. Uranium, gold. I didn't see any silicon, though. Alright, I'm back at my ship, and uh, I did get a lot of gold, but I couldn't find any silicon. And uh, I actually got lost, and I was afraid I wasn't going to be able to find my way back. But I did. So let's, um, let's just throw the gold in the refinery for now, uh, along with the stone. And uh, I'm going to actually go searching for a silicon off camera because I don't know where it is and it could be a lengthy search. So I will find some and when I do, I will come right back. And I stepped foot outside my uh, ship, not two feet behind it, and I found some silicon. So that's kind of funny. Uh, <laughs> I don't know where the gravity is pointing to though, let's see. Alright, the gravity's pointing down there. Where's it going to go? Alright. If it settles down there, that's fine. I just don't want it to go flying off into space. No, nope, like it is. Damn it. The gravity's not set up properly. Alright, that one's gone. So this is going to be a bit of a, of a problem here. Yeah, it really flies off. Ugh. Yeah, this is a problem. I'm, I'm going to have to move my ship. I didn't want to have to, but I really don't have much choice. I mean, I'm probably going to need a lot more. Oh, wait, cobalt? Yeah, let's move my ship, because I need the gravity over there. All right. <coughs> Excuse me. Alright, let's get this bad boy into position. Now, where was it? It was behind. Yeah, it was over there, I think. Yeah, it looks about right. Alright, let's go like this. We do have 50 minutes of flying time, which is pretty cool. Alright, and uh... That should be good. Jetpack enabled. Alright, come on. Alright. I have so many plans for this game. Oh god, this game's gonna give me motion sickness though. Alright, that's Cobalt. And um this is where I was, wasn't it? Pretty sure. Yeah, this is that's iron. Here is a silicon. Alright, let's see where the gravity is. Perfect. Oh, this is nice. This is good. I love having that ship above me, man. When I was... Actually, I think I'm just getting to the silicon now. Oh, well, whatever. Like I said, I could use all this stuff, so it doesn't even matter. By the way, running down around here to pick everything up is the worst part. I hate it. Um, Alright, well, we got a lot of stuff. Let's come on up here and see if we got enough. First thing we'll do is put in a refinery. Can I get the refinery from over here? Yep, there's a the refinery. Alright. Silicon ore, then we'll do the cobalt, and then stone. Alright, so let's see what we got in the assembler. I forget what I was making. All right, so got the wafers. So we need I need computer parts. I need displays. All right, we need more silicon wafers, but they're being made. Um, what else do I need? Computer display, motors, interior plates. Uh, interior plates. 
Okay, I already got some of those. Probably gonna need more, though. Let's just make more. More computers. We're gonna need, um... We're gonna need thruster components, I know that. We're going to need... Motors. Alright, so we need nickel and cobalt. Um, the cobalt is in there, being processed. But the nickel, we're gonna need more nickel. Hopefully there's some nickel below me, so I don't have to move the ship again. Let's see what we got in the refinery. Silicon, cobalt. Yeah, we're gonna need more nickel. Damn it. I don't know if we have any nickel down here. I think they're... Cobalt, iron... Nickel! Here we go. And this should be... Gravity... There we go. Beautiful. This is a good spot right here. And that stuff's all going... Yep, okay, good. As long as it doesn't fly off into space, I'm happy. Yeah, it's, it's funny, uh, using the jackhammer is not the worst part. The worst part is having to pick that damn stuff up. That's why, I, that's why what I'm working on right now, I don't know if I was clear on this, but what I'm working on right now is, I'm going to get some, no, no, this is all nickel, that's okay. We'll get some more uranium later. What I'm working on right now is a, is a, is a drilling ship. And the drills that I make will automatically pick up the stuff that it... Well, most of the stuff. So. Alright, that should be good. See, when I when I first played this on the stream, I didn't know about the... Uh, that the ship would, like... If you brought a ship over and turned on the gravity, it would work on, you know, the asteroid you're, you're working on. So I didn't do that. Um, and that makes it so much easier. I was watching some dude let's play, some dudes let's play today. I forget who. I actually sent him a message and asked him when I do a collaboration or something because he really knows what he's doing. He seems like a cool guy. So uh, hopefully he'll get together with me on a collaboration. You know, we'll see if we can get him on the channel. Um, but yeah, he he knows what he's doing. He's been playing this game for a while. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm really excited about this game. I, I I've owned this game for quite a while honestly, but uh, I never wanted to play it before because they just a few weeks ago put in survival mode and uh, I didn't want to play creative. I mean, I didn't play creative on Minecraft. I wouldn't play it on this. Um, so, ooh, what's that? Is that? Iron ore, okay. Uh, so yeah, so basically I um, I was just waiting for, uh, for survival mode. It's what I like. It's what I enjoy. All right, that's a refinery. So we're going to need nickel, cobalt. We'll put the nickel here. And stone will definitely be last. I don't give a rat's ass about stone. And let's see if anything's being made yet. All right, some things are, some aren't. Let's just take out everything we have and uh, go see what we can make. Now we're going to have to find where, that, where the uh, ship is we were building. I don't remember where it was. I think it was over this way. Yeah, I think it's over this way. Uh, maybe not. There it is. All right, so it's it's just one crater over, no big deal. And it's a it, because the um the thing around it is green. That means it's actually locked down, so it's not going to go anywhere. All right, so four. Um, that's facing the front, right? Yep. There we go. Now we'll get that off our hot bar. There we go. And, alright. So let's go ahead and build some of this if we can. First things first, build from the bottom up. We're going to need the motors, but we'll build whatever we can. There we go. These are just steel plates. The light armor block are just steel plates, so we can actually build those. I wonder if I can get to the one in the middle. I don't think I can. Okay, I can't get to the one in the middle, so let's take the grinder. The grinder allows us to remove blocks. Oops. Oh, shit! No, 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 no. God damn it. You get back down there. Ah, oh, Christ. I didn't mean to do that. Come on, get down there. Get in front of it. There we go. Get down there. Alright, we need to get our ship over here. We need gravity. Come on. No, 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 no. Stop, 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 stop. Oh, my goodness. Alright, stay cool, Cage. Stay cool. 
Ugh, man. What happened was I accidentally broke the block behind the one that I was trying to break, break and it severed the connection. So, oh, God. The thing that I was on started floating away. And there it goes. I don't know if there's anything I can do to get it. Ah, fuck it. It's gone. Oh, maybe not. Let's go. Give it some gravity. Come on, come on, come on. If I'm close to it, shouldn't, it have, shouldn't the area have gravity and it should fall? Shouldn't it be falling? I don't know why it's not falling. Maybe it's too high. Well, I think there's one other thing I can do with it. I can probably uh, take it completely apart, get all the items back that were on it, and just rebuild it down below. This is risky for a very small payout. Um, I want to get the cockpit at least. Oh, there we go. Alright, so whenever you um, use this, uh, this uh, grinder thing on it, I think you get almost everything back. If not everything. There we go. Woo! That was intense. Yeah, I think you get most of the materials back, if not all of them, actually. Which is pretty cool. So, alright, we really messed that one up. Let's get back in our ship. This is, an, this is a learning process for me. I'm no, by no means an expert on this game. Alright. Alright, so let's get back into position for the the thing we're building. There it is. We, we need gravity for it. We can do it without gravity, but it's very tricky, as you can tell. What the hell? Oh, no. Oh, no. I think I just destroyed my ship. Ah, oh, crap. I just crashed my ship. Oh, God, no. Um, is there any way I can get it out of there? Oh, man. I didn't think I was that close. I lost my thrusters. All of them? And a gyroscope? Uh, yeah, I think I'm screwed. Where is my gyroscope? Wait, wait, my gyroscope is in the back, wasn't it? How did I lose it? This is a gyroscope right here. Yeah, I didn't lose my gyroscope. What the hell? Um, I don't know what's going on. Give me a minute. Let me see. What, let me try and figure this out. Okay, what I think happened here is I think I broke the blocks below me. So this uh, cockpit is not connected to the rest of the ship. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my light armor blocks and I'm going to just try and replace them as best I can. I did cut apart some of this. Uh, yeah, look, the cockpit's not connected. That's what it is. Why can't I place that? Um, hold on. Let me see what this is. Uh, light armor slope. Repair that. And see if we can place this now. I can't place it. It looks like the rocks are in the way. Yeah, it looks like I crashed in these rocks right here. So let's uh, cut some of these rocks out of the way. Alright. Pretty sure this is the problem. No, it's still not going. I'm not sure why it's not placing. Let me uh let me see if I can place it from the inside. Yeah, you can see right there the cockpit has nothing to lay on. Alright, uh three. Yeah, it's not letting me place it. I'm not sure why. I might have to tear the cockpit up as well. Looks like the cockpit's kind of sloped down. 
It's the only other thing I can think of is it's the cockpit. Let me try one more thing, and then I might have to take the cockpit up, yeah. Looks like the cockpit's in the way. Or it could be the stone. I wish it would tell me it was in the way. Uh, I guess it could be the stone. I don't think it is, though. I really don't want to have to pick that cock... I don't want to have to take the cockpit back up and replace it. Although, I think I do get everything back I need for it. Yeah. Cockpit's in the way. Alright, so... Yeah, let's take out the cockpit. Uh, I don't have much choice. Uh, there we go. Get in there, get in there. There we go. So as you take the cockpit away, it's going to give you all the materials back. But you want to make sure you have enough room in your inventory for it, or the materials will fall all over the ground. Uh, and I just took damage for no reason. Eh. What are you going to do? It's a beta. Or alpha. Whatever. I'm just going to put everything away except for my grinder. And let's take this bad boy apart. We'll build another one. So, yeah, here we are taking this apart. You can see I'm getting the interior plates, the construction components, everything back. And I'm going to, from time to time, make sure I have room for everything. Because I don't want stuff dropping on the ground. Because with the gravity, they could go down pretty far. Um, I'm 160 of 4,000 L. I guess that's... I don't know what L is. The only thing I can think of L is liters. But that's a measurement for liquid. So, not quite sure what that means. But uh, we're going to take the cockpit apart. We're going to... We're going to put the plates behind, uh, below it. Now, the, if the cockpit is not attached to a plate underneath it, it's not going to work, basically. It's not, it's not going to be attached to the rest of the ship. So I'm pretty sure that's what happened. And I'm not even going to reset my timer. Uh, I stopped it. I paused it, you know, when I make cuts, but I'm not even going to restart it because I'll be done when I'm done. I can't leave this like this. So this will probably be a longer of an episode. So now we want to be careful here, because once this is gone, we don't want to break whatever's behind it. There we go. Alright, so... Number three. And I need steel plates. Okay. It's going to let me build it, though, so that's good. Alright, steel plates. Got it. Three steel plates. There we go. That was the problem. Alright, let's go look underneath and see what else we can build underneath there to steady this a little bit. Although, I kind of just want to get going, you know. Alright. Yeah, we don't have enough room here. Let's just build this one and be done with it. Alright, we need to get our welding tool. Come on. Come on. No, no, no. Down here. There we go. All right, let's grab our welding, welding tool. I keep taking damage when I walk up these stairs when I sprint up them. I'm not quite sure, but it's kind of annoying. Um, well, they're it's already in there. Okay. Let's go ahead and heal back up so we don't accidentally get ourselves killed. Plus, we are running low on energy. That's good enough. All right. So there we go. We're going to go ahead and build this. Um, pretty easy repair. We just I just didn't know what the problem was. You know. So there we go. Going along. I think once, it, once it's above that red line, it's built. And then it's just repairing after that. Alright, so let's go ahead and find our cockpit. Number five. And let's rotate it. There we go. Alright. And we should have, we better have everything for this. Yeah, we do. Because whenever you take it apart, you do get everything back. Alright, and here we are. And the cockpit is just about done. Um, so, let's make sure this is going to work. Almost done. Come on, come on, come on, come on. There we go. And T. And there we go. Alright. Alright, guys, look at that. We learned something there. We uh, we have our thrusters, we have our gyroscope. Yeah, everything was still in. It was just not being recognized. So, all right. So let's go over to our gravity generator and make sure that's still on. That's on. It's fine. So let's get back down. Let's get down and do what we were doing. Yeah, I basically just crashed. <laughs> it's pretty funny. 
All right. So what we're going to do is we're going to put this block on there and now we're going to make it because this is what the problem was. We put that one block in the middle and then we couldn't get to it to, to actually craft it. It's not like other games where you make the block and then place them. You got to you got to make the block, you got to place it and it kind of like starts it. It's kind of like a, a I don't know, like a scaffolding, like the outline of something and then you got to go like that. So let's go ahead and make these. And you can see it, they just take one steel plate. They're actually quite cheap. The the hardest the hardest thing about them is how long it takes them to weld. I mean, they actually take a bit of time to weld considering how small they are. The gravity's not perfect down here, but you know what? Let's just turn our jetpack on. Might be easier. I basically want to keep the gravity down here, so if something comes apart, it doesn't go flying off into space again. It's not so much for me. Alright, there we go. Alright, so that's pretty cool. I mean, we, we crashed our ship, and I was really nervous. I was, I was really scared that I did some irreversible damage or something. But, uh, no, not so much. Just gotta replace what you broke. That's all. Just gotta make sure you don't break your refinery. If you break your refinery, you could be in a lot of trouble. As a matter of fact, when we get up there, we should check on, uh, how we're doing for, uh, fuel. Because we probably should go get some more uranium at some point. Alright, so let's go ahead and put the cockpit on. And that is forward. So, five. Oh, boy. That's all messed up. Uh, what are we doing here? Um, what the hell? I'm not sure why it's not going to the right. Wait, like that? And, like... No. Ah! There we go. I need interior plates. Okay, well let's go get some interior plates. We will place this cockpit and then we're going to be done for this video because I don't even know how long this video is. Uh, I do not know to need to go inside. I need to come up here. Alright, interior plates. They're probably in the cargo ship. There we go. Interior plates. Let's just take all this stuff. That's the nice part about... Uh, having more inventory space. You don't have to take like one item at a time. It's definitely more realistic, but I don't think it's more fun. And it's definitely a lot harder for a Let's Play. Alright, so yeah, that'll work. And let's put this bad boy down. There we go. And let's go ahead and make it. And we have everything we need except for the bulletproof glass and the motor. So let's go get the bulletproof glass and the motor. I want this thing built. Um, and then we'll finish this up next video. It probably would have been finished this video, but uh, to be honest, I don't really know the design I want anyway. Like, this is all new to me, and yeah. Bulletproof glass. I don't think we ever made any bulletproof glass. Um, all right, we need some more platinum, but uh, we're not going to worry about that right now. Let's uh, actually take this out. Missing items. What's that missing? Okay, and the bulletproof glass. Let's go ahead and save. Quick auto save. That's the one thing we could have did. Um, if we did lose our ship, we could have just reloaded. That's why I auto save. I just need to remember not to save at the end uh, when I leave. All right, well, that's doing its thing. Let's come over here and check out the refinery. And the refinery is, okay, still doing its thing. Let's go inside and see how much time we have left uh, as far as fuel goes. Uh, come on, come on, come on, come on. Killing me, game. Not easy walking around in space. All right, so we have three hours left of fuel time. That's without flying. Um, it's not great. Um, we're going to have to get some more, uh, some more uranium. I'll probably get more uranium between this video and next. Just so you guys don't have to sit through. You've seen me do it. You know how I do it. It's not really a big deal. 
Alright. Um so go over here. And what do we okay there we go. Alright. Let's go build this sucker. Where is it? Man, this game gets this game gets me dizzy. Like it literally gets me dizzy. It's pretty funny. All right, and that is going to be the landing gear and the cockpit and the base of the cockpit. I have to decide where I'm going to put the drill. I'll probably put a single drill in front. Usually you put two drills. You put one on the right side, one on the left. I'll probably put a single drill in front. And uh, I don't know. I really don't have any clue how I'm going to do this, to be honest. But it'll probably be a mess. Um, it's kind of like Minecraft. Look, when you first start playing Minecraft or even Seven Days to Die, like your first buildings like aren't the best. But um, that's kind of going to be what this is going to be like. All right, so there it's done. It just needs to be repaired. So let's go ahead and get in it. T, and there we are. There's the cockpit view. Now we can't do anything. We don't have any thrusters. We don't have a gyroscope. We don't have anything. But that is the cockpit. So I'm going to go ahead and finish uh, building this, and that's going to be it for episode two. Uh, please, if you want to see more of this, thumbs up and uh, let me know in the comments. And if you have any tips for me or anything, uh, let me know those as well. So that's going to be it for episode two. We'll see you next time for episode three. Till then, take it easy.